Since Philip Schofield left this morning, the long-running daytime show has been rocked by a series of dramas. Initially, the 61-year-old stepped down from his presenting role following reports that he had fallen out with his co-host Holly Willoughby. Although he was set to continue his working relationship with ITV, he has now quit the channel with immediate effect after confessing to an affair. Philip took to social media on Friday evening to admit to having an affair with a younger male runner who used to work on the show. Since then, there have been sources claiming that this morning's future is hanging by a thread with uncertainty on its future. Philip Schofield's ex-lover claims he was never asked by ITV about affairs speaking about the controversy on GB News, presenter Stephen Dixon asked if this morning as a brand could survive. Showbiz reporter Stephanie Tukey said, even before this scandal came out, a lot of people had been saying, we have a wealth of TV talent in this country. It seems that this morning has turned stale, from Qgate people were talking about how they were bored of Holly and Phil. ITV just seemed determined to keep them there and keep the show there. Don't miss. Dermot O'Leary says we love making the show as he addresses this morning row, video, Good Morning Britain fans slam a pulling at balls over a car crash interview, reaction, Coronation Street's Gemma star on hidden BSL chat in wedding viewers may miss, so, there's no doubt in my mind that they're going to have to rebrand because to be honest, people aren't going to be focused on the show, they're going to be focused on the controversy. However, an ITV spokesperson has denied reports that the show's future is in question. They commented, as we said on the record yesterday, this morning is not under review and there are no plans for the show to be axed. Following Philip's exit, there's been reports of there being toxicity in the workplace as the former doctor on the show Ranj Singh claimed he was managed out after taking his concerns to people at the top of him. However, on Monday morning, Philip broke his silence on the accusation made against the broadcaster. Taking to his Instagram, he said, Now I no longer work on it this morning I am free to say this. I hope you have noticed that it's the same handful of people with a grudge against me or the show who seem to have the loudest voice. This morning is the best show to work on, with the best people. In all the years I worked there there was no toxicity. You can listen to those persistently loud voices if you like. But the thousands of guests over the years, thousands of staff and crew, hundreds of presenters and contributors all know, it is a family of wonderful, talented, kind and hard-working people. Sick This Morning continues weekdays on ITV from 10am.